There you are. <laughs> I was waiting since forever. You have no idea how many people were just staring at me. I guess I'm used to being the center of attention, but that was in an awkward way. Dylan was trying to hit me up with some small talk and I was getting bad chills down my spine the whole time whilst I was waiting for you. I was starting to think that you would abandon a girl like me like this. <laughs> hmm? Well, why wouldn't I wait for you? My prom date. Oh, what are we talking about? Putting that aside, you... You look really charming. I really like red on you. Never thought it'd be such a great match. I don't think no one has ever seen you like this on campus before. I don't know. You just feel so much more different. In a good way, of course. Oh, thank you. Receiving a compliment from you feels equally as good as well. Well, enough small talk. <laughs> Shall we head in? Uh, um, I forgot to ask. Um, how well are you with drinks? <laughs> what do you mean? It's kind of impossible to refuse a drink here. Don't you think? In that case, should I be on the lookout for you? <laughs> well, I don't want to be the one accompanying my prom date to the washroom as you throw up, do I? I was giving a hypothetical situation, silly. <laughs> I just want to know your limits, but if you insist, it's fine. I guess I'll have to take your word for it. And maybe find out myself. <laughs> oh, and just to put it out there, if you actually need it to puke, I will help you out and just try to remember to not throw up on my dress. <laughs> what am I talking about? <laughs> we are here for a great time, not for a long time. <laughs> um, referring to the party, of course, that is. <laughs> oh, hey, Jacob, surely? <laughs> Come on, I know it's a party, but let me introduce to you some of the schoolmates around. I can assure you that they're super friendly and you'll like them as well. <laughs> you don't have to talk that much. You can just stay by my side and let me try to warm you up to them. Break the ice between you guys. <laughs> I'm confident I can do it. <laughs> Please? <laughs> So, um, hey guys, um, this was the one I was talking about the whole time. <laughs> yeah, um, let me introduce you guys. This is... <sighs> Do you need some water? Sly, I mean, you clearly need some. Please, have a drink. Three, two, one. One, two, three. <laughs> hey, Earth to my prom date. <laughs> Can you hear me? <laughs> Good. Just have some water to freshen up. <laughs> if you're asking about that, no, you did not embarrass yourself by puking in the middle of the dance floor. <laughs> you... Well, Emily told me that 
You passed out whilst talking to her on your fourth drink. And now you just woke up in my arms on the balcony we are. You shouldn't be the one apologizing. I... I should have been with you then. I know I was the one who brought you here, but... I would like to spend some alone time for the both of us, if that's alright with you. Well, I am used to crowds, but... Just for tonight... I think I'm good without them. You know, I'm... I'm sorry for always dragging you everywhere I go. I know you're busy, and yet... I asked for you again today. I just feel the happiest when you are around and it's hard to explain how I feel but could you accept my selfish request once again and just stay like this for a bit? <laughs> Thank you, I... I just wanted to catch a breather myself as well <laughs> from all this. <laughs> well, you did seem pretty friendly with Emily earlier. <laughs> just before I came to steal you away or quote unquote save your day. <laughs> so, how do you find her? Yeah, she's a nice girl. <laughs> I don't need you to tell me that. Uh, nothing. <laughs> I'm not jealous. <laughs> I'm just... being... possessive. No, we... were never together to begin with. I... Know that very really well myself. I mean, you are my prom date, right? It wouldn't be right with me if I see you with some other person talking overly friendly like that. With you in my arms like this, um intertwining my fingers with yours. <laughs> I guess I could say I regret not showing intimacy when we were in there. I saw so many couples being all lovey-dovey with their public display of affection, I thought. I was the one out of place with you. Uh, not that it was your fault at all, but <sighs> that was just a thought of mine. Well, don't you think it's okay to be this close to each other? <laughs> I'm glad you think alike. <laughs> it should be fine, isn't it? We are away from the rest of the crowd and, and it's too dark for anyone to see us together like this. <laughs> hmm? What's wrong? You seem out of it. Is it the atmosphere of the party? Something off to you? Or maybe perhaps is there something on your mind you don't mind sharing? Um, that's... There's no way I would think that way. Uh, hey, 
I didn't ask you out with me because I thought you were easy or anything like that. I would have never thought of you that way. Yes, in the eyes of other students or friends, I may be in their words, quote unquote, out of your league, but I can assure you it's nothing like that. It's nothing near that thought. There are no lines between us. <laughs> And if you do agree with that thought, then what if I tell you I do think that I don't deserve someone like you? <laughs> You may think that I may be the popular kid, but you make me feel nowhere as close as the others had made me feel. <laughs> I was basically beaming from ear to ear today. I was able to live in the moment for once, and it was because of you beside me. And believe it or not, I didn't used to be like this. I was a pretty quiet kid like you and somehow one day, <laughs> the extroverts adopted me and slowly the center of attention was just being beamed at me. But being alone in the spotlight Despite having so many friends around me, I can get a little lonely. But when I'm with you, it's never that way. I asked you to be my prom date and wanted you to meet my friends because I felt the most comfortable with you and Obviously, I want my friends to like you as well. You... You do know what I'm trying to say, right? I... I wanted you to come with me because I... I like you. <laughs> It's that simple, really. Well... Not really simple, but you get what I mean, don't you? <laughs> You're not drunk nor seeing things, idiot. <laughs> I really do like you. <laughs> if, if you truly don't believe it, maybe I can prove it to you. If you like. <laughs> Believe me now. <laughs> This is the reality, silly. You and me, alone in this night together. With you in my arms as well. It's all real. <laughs> But what about you? You've hurt my feelings, so do you feel the same towards me? Asking under this moonlight, <laughs> you look even more endearing, especially, especially after that kiss I shared. <laughs> Can I really say no to you calling me princess like that? <laughs> But this princess was the one who saved you today, right? <laughs> Well, maybe in the next chapter, 
you can do the same for me. If the story is ours to write, he might as well make it all about us, right? <laughs> My one and only you. 